Hi beautiful souls, this is Clara speaking. Today's topic is I am an imposter and I want to fully embrace being an imposter and not a small one, a big one, a humongous one, fully, fully, fully embrace it. So I, I feel a little bit like somebody sitting with a smile at a funeral <laughs> because how is it possible to feel or to admit not just on camera, on YouTube, I am an imposter and then still feel great about it. And this is where the most amazing um, rele revelation came to me. And I asked the upstairs department, but why? <laughs> why do I get to say, um, I'm an imposter when everybody else got to say like, oh, the imposter syndrome isn't, isn't like they're not imposters. And they said, well, I first have to admit that I am an imposter. And the moment I admitted I am an imposter, and I didn't just admit like for the sake of it, I actually thought, you know, like, like at what level do I not show up authentic and this is where spirit says first of all can you now see and feel that you are an imposter and the answer is yes absolutely 100 percent and why can i be so joyful about it because the moment i acknowledged it spirit came and said okay so now that you've embraced being the imposter, where are you Im impostering? I don't know if there's a word like that. But anyway, it is feeling smaller than what I am. Um, being victimized by life when I actually just have a sad story, but I don't feel victimized. When I dumb down myself, when I lessen my power so that I don't... Uh, become more than what the society wants me to be and in that way I am an imposter because I have been hiding I am an imposter because I have been dumbing down myself I did um, play smaller but why why did I take longer to speak the truth and most people take to just express a lie and in that way I did discover that I was not standing in my full power so there you have my confession and there is no need to subscribe if you must follow someone follow your own heart